Hey guys, this is Snack Attack 8, and welcome back to more Final Fantasy IX Blind. This is part 28, and we're gonna start off with an ATE active time event. We got no yummy yummies. What does this have to do with Queena? This town got no yummy yummies anywhere. <laughs> no yummy yummies, huh? We got rat girls. Yo, you no can make famous Alexandrian dish queen's meal? That does not sound appealing to me. Or famous Southgate bunt cake? No yummy yummies, huh? That's a damn shame. <laughs> Alright, so welcome back to Final Fantasy 7 9. Final Fantasy 7 9? Oh my god. If 7 of 9 needs a sign, what do you have? Cyborg! What? Maybe I should ask her to show me around town again. I haven't been a guide in ages. Okay. This is very odd. Oh, behind me lies the lair of Antlion, a foul beast. Been quite tame recently, but I do not recommend provoking it. Didn't we go back here in the last episode? I think we did. It's like a giant whirlpool. Yeah, okay. I guess that is the. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. Gil. <laughs> I guess this is the Antlion lair. Maybe we'll have to jump down here at some point. But right now, I think I'm going to leave it be. That's some Final Fantasy IV right there. Straight out of dat. Welcome back. It's been a while since our last video was put up. Oh, more? Phoenix Pinion. That's good. It has been a little bit, and I apologize for that. Uh, the big reason being that I was out in Las Vegas doing my uh, my last weekend of my leadership training that, that, that I think a lot of you guys know that I've been in now. Um, don't hate me. Don't hate me because you ain't me. I was out doing that, and I just decided to take a little break um, while I was out focusing on that on that stuff. But we're back now, and we're, we're we're ready to get back into Final Fantasy IX and get get busting heads, figuring out what's going on here in Clara. Look, pony-headed devil. Oh, oh, they must. This must be. Oh, they yeah, Burmesian refugee, huh? These must be people who think Vivi's evil because they saw what the other black mages did. What is that, Eva? <laughs> Dan! Didn't we meet you, Dan? Didn't we meet you in Burmesia? Leave my family alone! Oh no. Come on. <laughs> Cut him some slack. He doesn't look that much like them. He looks a little bit different. It can't be good for his self esteem. <laughs> Tiny fraction of us made it to Clara. Damn it! I know. It's bad. Din. Is he Are you related to Dan? Maybe a cousin or a bro? Hope everyone who stayed in Burmesia is okay. Uh, I don't know about that. A moon maiden? The sandstorm that protects our town is powered by magic. To keep the storm in motion, we perform a sacred dance to the melody of a harp adorned with a magic stone. That sounds like some Zelda right there. If I do say so. Oh man, I, what? Thunder gloves? I didn't even know that was something I could interact with. I was just trying to read the sign. Uh, okay. Let's take a look at that. Oh, I bet those are for Freya. Thunder gloves. Yes, they are. Okay, well, good, I guess. We didn't have that item before. So we got to maybe skip out on buying something in a shop here. It says plaza. Plaza of, of something. Is there a way I can go over here? No, there's a thing, though. What? Uh, like, there's no chests and stuff. Am I, like, where am I getting those items from? What's the, oh, this is... Oh, so it's like a loop. Right? Didn't I come up the other way to get through here? Let's see. This is all a lot. I knew this would happen. Like, I knew at the end of the last episode, I was like, we just got a tour of Clara. Come back next time for me figuring it all out again, because it's hard to get an idea of... Oh, are you a shop? Oh my god. More shopping to do. <laughs> I don't want to do this right now. Uh, I read some comments on the last video here and there, um, just because I had heard something from a couple people about people saying stuff in the comments, and it seems like a lot of them showed some frustration that I... That it seemed like people thought I didn't understand that the amount of items I have and the ones that I have equipped are over here on the right, like in that little thing. And I've known about that since the beginning of the game, like I've got that. Uh, but. Well, I guess what I was confusing me before was that 
Our parties are split up right now, and I didn't realize that what you get in one party is like... I, like, I still don't know. Like, if I pick something up, if I pick something up as Garnet or Steiner, would I be able to access it right now? Like, that was what was confusing me, is that I had my parties split up. I didn't know how many items I had and how many I didn't because, like, we're in different places. Because... I don't know. Like, because <laughs> didn't we buy this extra coral ring? Or no, that's just one coral ring. And no one's wearing that right now, right? No. Okay, so the, I, <laughs> the inventories must be split then. So that's what was throwing me off, is that I didn't realize that the things I picked up as Garnet and Steiner were not available to me as the Dane and, and this group. And just because we were in two different places and, like, there was a bunch of items, new stuff to get, it just, like, was confusing to me and threw me off. And I may have made, like, I, I noticed looking back that, like, I made some purchases that were a little bit unnecessary, but it was just, like, I don't know, because of that. Like, it's just messed with me. Um, but we'll try to make this a little bit faster. So I'm going to get a partisan, because I know for sure we don't have anything like that. We have two of these bone wrists. Vivi might be able to use one. I wish, here's what I wish, I wish it would show me what those things did, because there's a lot of items in this game and I just can't remember. Add status. I don't think Vivi even can learn that. Um, and it gives strength evade and magic evade. I feel like he doesn't really need that that much. Right? I know Garnet can't learn add status. I don't know if Vivi can. This isn't very expensive though. Um, but we can always just give him one of the ones that we have if I want to get him that ability. Mithril armlet. We don't have any of these. So I'm going to get three of those. Got mithril gloves. We just got these thunder gloves. Hey. I saved out spending some money there. May just had I know we got a million of those. Bandana is one. And that's pretty good. I might get two of those. May just had get some of those. Get one of those. <laughs> yeah, good thing we have some money. Um I have a I have a mithril vest. Um didn't I just pick that up? I feel like, is that the thing that has auto potion on it? I feel like that's not that good. Mithril vest. It is. How do I remember that? <laughs> it gives two defense and one strength and doesn't have a great ability on it. Or it negates one strength. Um, I guess that could be okay. We might pick up like one more of those just for the sake of it. Cause can't everyone wear that? Or a lot of us? Vivi can wear it. He probably wants defense more than he wants a strength point. So we'll get one more of those for him to wear. Queena, like, I, I don't, whatever. Queena's fine with what he's got. And we got chain mail and mithril armor. I don't have either of those, these things. So maybe I'll get one of each. Again, I can't remember what chain mail does. I don't know if Steiner has it or not, but like, I just don't, there's no way for me to tell that. Is, is there? Like, it doesn't, let me just make sure that it doesn't, like, even this, like, hold on, earth and water damage, well, it gives me that, but it doesn't give me the abilities or the stats of the item or anything, right? No, it doesn't, which I don't like, I wish it did, I wish this wasn't, like, I don't know, <laughs> that bothers me in RPGs, I know a lot of old ones have that issue, where you can't see how many... Like, you can't see all the stat growths you're gonna get on, like, getting a new piece of equipment until you buy it. You can see that, like, it'll maybe increase your attack or your defense a little bit. But that's not everything. I don't know. But I guess it doesn't hurt too bad to have a bunch of items. Got an in here. Right? No, I don't want to stay here. I am a little hurt. Um, between episodes, I went back down to that Moogle that was in the tree. With, and I, I, I wanted to go back there with Queena because there were some enemies I wanted to eat. But I guess just like like Zidane is the only one who can leave the town right now. Because everyone else is bopping around. Um, man, see this bandana, like it really is good. What is it? Is there anything it reduces? Defense. Eh, <laughs> I don't know. We're going to keep this on for now though. Nothing I got. Oh, is it, yeah, Zidane can get where this. That increases some things. I'll put that on him right now, actually. He can start working at Bug Killer. It's honestly not bad. Everything else, I think, is is fine. You don't want to wear this, right? No. 
Okay, yeah. That's good. Alright, Mithril Armlet seems seems like a decent thing. Man, I'm just getting all kinds of stuff. There's all kinds of goodies to be picked up in Clara. Here is who I wanted to talk to. The Moogle. Mopley? There's a letter for Zidane. Oh, what? For me? From Ruby? More Ruby stuff? Decided to start a small theater, but I ain't had any luck finding actors. Know any good actors who are looking for work? Wish you all were here. You Tantalus guys look like a bunch of outlaws. Okay. I want to become an actor. Maybe Ruby can start like an all Moogle show or something at her new home. Mopley wants mail. We don't have any mail to give to him though. Um, so let's save, I guess, real quick. We bought some stuff. Why not? Doing slot two. <laughs> Doing it in slot two. All the way. <laughs> it's really super funny and not childish. But I'm a child. I can't help it. I'm a child at heart. I like this tree environment. I really just like trees and like tree houses and stuff. When I was a kid, I always wanted a tree house and we never had one. But we did have like a neighbor. Whoa. We had, not neighbor, but like family friends that we used to go like have like play dates or whatever you do when you're a kid like <laughs> we used to go over to their house my sister and I and they had like maybe the coolest tree house I've ever seen it had like multiple rooms and like I think their dad like built it with his own hands it was just like it was wild I miss it I would still play in it if I could but I bet those people don't even live in that house anymore and I bet whoever moved in took the tree house out assholes why'd you do that <laughs> here's Vivi didn't we just like didn't they just say they didn't think Vivi was bad? Did I do this out of order or something? Okay. I guess we know how this resolves. You shouldn't curse in front of your kids. That's not a nice thing to do. A bit touchy today, aren't we? Donegan? He's one of the demons that sacked Bermesia. You don't know that, dude. I haven't hurt anyone. Oh, Veeves. I just want to go swaddle him. If I go back to that inn, can I, can I see Vivi? Is he here now? Here, isn't this them? Dan and the the wife and the kids? Jack? I don't think he was a demon. <laughs> Alright, well... Hold on. Are you in here, Vivi? There he is. That was weird. How did I... How did I miss that? I've never done anything bad. Oh, well, come... Come on, dude. <laughs> uh, Vivi, you're killing me. The gloomiest, the gloomiest Gus of them all, truly. We didn't explore over here though, so let's look. I feel like if I was here in real life, this would be actually kind of scary. Star Maiden has some items to buy. I don't think we really need any of this stuff. Just real quick, go down it. No. We don't. Uh, Clara has not seen visitors for hundreds of years. Okay. I would be kind of scared to be here, I think, because it's like way high up, first of all. You've got these sand winds blowing that are probably pretty, uh, pretty harsh. You just get blown right off, maybe. A mushroom. Is this back to the queen of story? It is. <laughs> mushroom! Never seen a kind like this before. Looking around. Oh, I bet he's just gonna eat it. Hope it's edible. Let me taste test it to find out. That's a safe, surefire way to not die. Are you friends of that apron clad individual? Yes. I don't know if friends is the right word, but we're acquaintances for sure. Wonder where she or he learned to speak so strangely. They, Queena does have a way with words, I suppose. If you want to call it that. Alright, All right, so this is leads back up through here. And this leads... So this loops around kind of too. Right? Where does this go? This way down here. I think there was another way up. I think up is where we want to end up. Because... Is Queen not around? <laughs> we want to end up at that uh, temple place where Freya went to like meet with the elder or something. So I just want to make sure every I got every like nook and cranny covered though. Let's see. There was one other way to go through here, right? Look at this cool little pool though. Like, man, this game is pretty. It looks great. <laughs> I'm real always impressed by these backgrounds. I bet, whoa, hey, wait a minute. Something in the grass. Gissel greens, are they, are they growing in this little garden right here? Was that like a touch? It's a nice touch. 
This, yeah, okay, so that leads up here. So we did see everything that we could. And now we're gonna go in the temple, I guess. The Wind Maiden, Eileen, who we need to tell to come on. Promesians are like us Clarins in that both societies value dance. Our tradition is older. Our dance evoke, dances evoke greater power than those of Promesia. Okay. I get it. You don't have to brag about your dances to me. Also, why did I skip through getting that item? Is it anything, like, new equipment-wise? Ugh. I wish I could run right back and see that. Manual arrangement. Oh, no, that won't let us do it. There's no way to arrange by, like, newest item got. Does it look like we got anything new? I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't matter that much. <laughs> I can always look back at it in, in editing or something. In days of old, the folk of Clara and Bermesia lived under the same sky. But Clarins fled to the tree to avoid conflict with the Bermesians. So if the if the Clarins came here after they left Bermesia, how do they have an older tradition of dance here than they did there? Bermesians began to value the arts of war. Because wouldn't they have gotten their tradition from there in the first place? These are, these are the Bermesians. Gary, what a name. Kind of stiff, but they're nice once you get to know them. Well, it seems like they're doing okay here, the people who did survive. I just wish we'd gotten more out. If only we'd gotten there in time. If only I hadn't dicked around with a chocobo game. Instead of coming here when I could. But, something tells me it wouldn't have made any difference anyway. I have a message for Master, Vida Master Zidane from Lady Freya. To convey the following. Zidane, this may take some time, so wait at the inn. Alright. Well, that was worth a lot. <laughs> Coming all the way up here. We got a bunch of items on the way up, though. Equipment, all kinds of good stuff. So I'll, I'll, I'll take a load off. I'll wait at the end. The end's down here, right? Yes, it is. Okay. And our, our friends are gone. Help? Uh-oh. What's the matter? The antlion's mauling a kid! Oh my god! It's usually so docile. Gotta teach that beast a lesson. Immediate action. Tell the high priest. <laughs> yeah, he's not moving very fast. Give me a hand if you think you're good enough. You know, I do think I'm good enough. And I want to get into a rumble. So let's go fight that ant lion. I want to get a look at it. I hope it does look like the Final Fantasy IV ant lion. Because I always thought that was a very, uh, very classic kind of design. Let's see, though. Ugh, hopefully the kid's not Vivi. If it is, you think he'd be able to handle himself. No, it's not. It's like a little rat kid. Oh, man, and it looks cool, too. Oh, jeez. Is that rat kid? Puck. Wasn't that his name? No! We're gonna save you, champ. That is him, isn't it? Isn't that the friend that Vivi met way back in the beginning of the game? Is that why he's knowing? We gotta save him. <laughs> that voice. Might be, might it be Prince Puck? Freya. Whoa. He threw him. Queena, you could have caught that. <laughs> Hurt you, jerk. It's coming. Oh man, we got a boss fight. I did not expect this to be happening. That means we got to do some stealing too. If only I could have equipped my items before I got into the fight. Ugh. Oh well. It kind of looks like the other ant lion. The one in four is so goofy looking though. That's what I like about it. This one's more serious. It's got like a cooler look. Like, you know what? Let's use uh, Race's Wind. I haven't really been using that, but it is like really useful, right? Because regen's like a great thing to have. You definitely want that. Let's, I forget what some of these abilities are. Reduces the defense. Maybe we can do that. Maybe that'll work. Trouble Mucus. Let's see what else we got. Oh, am I troubled? Looks, didn't look like anyone got troubled. Let's try poison. I don't know. Let's try some stuff. Freya is in trance. Um, we got regen going. Let's jump because Freya's jump in trance is really good. Let's see what else we can do with the rest of our party here. Zidane, I got. I saw he got that first steal, so we'll keep stealing. That looks like a miss. Queena honestly probably just wants to attack for this battle, um, but we'll see. Okay, so this thing does is not affected by poison. That's good to know. 
Maybe. Let's see. I don't know about any of the rest of this stuff. Oh man! Oh whoa! That hurts. Um. Okay. <laughs> Good thing we have regen on. Let's start using some of our abilities. I wanted to see if, if this guy's like sandy, right? So maybe like an aqua breath would work well on him? No. <laughs> good. Man, we're all darkened too. That's not good. Like, it, it's kind of crappy. Fortunately, I don't have to worry about Freya because she's in her like trance jump thing. But it's still, still kind of a scary spot to be in. We probably want to start getting some remedies jumping out too. If only I had a like an ability that negated blindness. Eye drops, that's probably what I want. Don't want remedies. It'd be like a waste kind of. Good thing Freya like <laughs> I love in these boss battles where like stealing is such a thing you can do. Like, I love Freya being like the only damage dealer in the party. Kinda makes me laugh. Alright, that wasn't so bad. Really wish again that we had Garnet so that she could use like her shell ability and stuff like that, but what are you gonna do? Get Mythra Best, okay, so two out of three, that's good. And that's only our second steal. So like that's pretty pretty awesome. Ray is back. You're not in still in trance, okay. I didn't think it works. Let's use a high potion on her too. Sedan can steal. Freya can probably just jump again. Trouble ugh, I don't like that. Why well, you gotta hit my girl? Come on, now I'm gonna waste that high potion. Well, Queen will probably just use it on himself. Oh no, he won't. He used eye drops. Never mind. I think Queen is probably going to be the one to revive Freya, and Vivi will attack this next turn coming up. So Dane, I need you to get that last steal in, dude. He doesn't have anything. Oh, excellent. All right. So let's just start dishing it out now. Ooh. All right, and you're troubled. So Vivi is going to use Blazara. So Dane is going to use an anointment. Right. Oh, that's what we got when we were up uh, up at the top there. I know I had three of those before because I just checked it out in my inventory. Freya's just going to jump because that way I don't have to heal anymore. Queen, however, is going to heal himself. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. We're okay. We're okay. Don't use... Please hit Zidane or someone. Vivi, that's fine. He can, he can take that. Can he? Ugh. Ugh. This isn't good. All my guys are getting hurt. I should have bought some high potions when I was when I had the chance. I need them. We might it might be worth to cast Race's Wind again when Freya gets back down. Because from what I understand. Oh there we go. Alright, Queena, you're just gonna attack. Get back on the offensive here, boys. Does Zidane have any good abilities or skills we can use? No. I don't think what's that will really work very well on this thing. Just a hunch. All right, and that Sandstorm ability, while like pretty damaging, it, it doesn't do enough to kill anyone. Like it doesn't look like it can get anyone down to kill level. Counterhorn? Whoa. Does this guy really have a physical attack counter? Ugh. <laughs> That's not what you want to see. Did I have everyone attack? I really hope I didn't. Oh, come on. Are you serious? This queen Is Queen not going to get any AP because of this? Oh. Why did that have to happen? I guess we beat it. Um, let's see. I don't know if he got AP or not. Hopefully he did. Or she did, whatever. Hopefully Queena did. There's the boss. I'm glad we got our steals out of it. Are you alright, your highness? What's up, Freya? This is that rat kid from the beginning, right? It would, I guess it would make sense if he was in Alexandria seeing the play, because if he's a prince, that would mean he would be a noble, right? Uh, how can this be? I've heard that your highness disappeared upon leaving Borussia. Let's go at once to the cathedral to inform his majesty. Okay. What? <laughs> he and Vivi are pals. He's so rude. Vivi much nicer. 
He's the first friend I ever had. Oh, I gotta tell him something. Really, that was the first friend Vivi ever had? Where did he even come from before he was in the story of this game? So you saw Puck, eh? So here's the king. And Puck doesn't want to see him for some reason? I haven't seen him in ages. Heard his highness left for me. See, once, one, what, what? So, oh, Puck left Bermesia after Freya did? That would make sense, I guess, He wound, if he wound up across the world. Heard his highness left Bermesia one month after me. That makes it three years. And yet, we both decided to return in this time of danger. I am grateful. So why did the prince leave? We shall conduct an ancient ceremony to strengthen the sandstorm. That probably is a good idea. No enemy would attack with a powerful storm protecting Clara. With the help of a dragon knight like you, the storm should grow even more powerful. Alrighty. What kind of ceremony is this going to be? Is it like a dance kind of thing? Like they said about the dance, like I guess that's important to the Burmesians. I met with utter failure when trying to defend Burmesia. And I will not allow Bronn to exert her will upon us any longer. Freya's got some spark back. I didn't think you were so strong when I first met you. That's because you were moping about all over the place. Hmm. All I can do is protect this beautiful place. That's good. So Freya has something to prove now. She was not able to defend Bermesia. But I guess she feels what she can do right now is protect this place. And that's worth, worth fighting for. Oh, they're for sure gonna dance. Whoa. <laughs> cool. The strings have snapped. That's because you were shredding too hard, Moon Maiden. Jamming on that harp. A terrible omen? Oh no. That's not good. Ooh. What did we mess up our footwork on the dance? Oh no. <laughs> Is the whole the whole sandstorm just going away? Or does this have something to do with the mages and uh, and Kuja's power? Is the sandstorm still strengthening? It doesn't look like it. It looks like it's fading. Why did that happen? Did our dance was our dancing really that bad? This is what would have happened if I danced the ceremonial dance. But it looked pretty good. They were getting a little jig on. Can't believe the sandstorm disappeared. What happened? I don't know. Never witnessed anything. <laughs> I've never witnessed dancing that bad since we settled here. On the harp, there's a magic stone. Looks like it. Looks pretty sparkly. It looked like something I wanted to get when I first saw it. Since ancient times, we've used the power of the stone to control the sandstorm. Want someone is trying to invade Clara? Well, duh, they are. Our. Can't you think of someone? I only hope our enemy don't come up the trunk. Where else would they come from? How dare they imprison us like this? Oh, now we're back to Steiner and Garnet. Wretched court gestures. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we got kidnapped by uh, Zorn and Thorn when we first appeared here. They'll never get away with this. Can't believe my Marcus is just here. No one asked you to come along. 
Pretty sad getting backstabbed by your own queen. At least we got a nice view of the female lady guards saluting down here and walking in tandem for some reason. Steiner is still trying to help the queen out in this situation. And it looks like they took Gyn Giner? Looks like they took Garnet off somewhere. Here she is. I wonder if Mother will ever listen to me. Why did she attack Bermesia? Why did she arrest us like this? I must be sincere with her. Be honest, be like, Mom, we gotta talk. You let yourself go, and I kinda am afraid that you're like a warmongering crazy person, so let's have a chat. <laughs> she hasn't been herself lately. She's been acting rather strange since my birthday last year. Same day that tall man visited us. He had something to do with it. That was when things began to change, right? Ah! Dr. Tot left Alexandria afterwards, okay. But Garnet can't quite remember exactly what happened, or she just doesn't know. Bronn summons you, uh-oh. I got a bad feeling about this. I haven't seen, seen Zorn and Thorn like this up close, and like they're really gross and creepy looking. Oh. What phrase? Get off me, you scumbag! Yeah. You should just fight him, Garnet. Are we gonna get to? No. We should be able to. Garnet has a pretty, like, decently damaging weapon right now. She should be able to fight these guys off. Hurry up. The queen has waited. I feel like we're gonna get something important here. But we, you know, we can keep this episode going. It can be a little bit longer. Mother. There you are, darling. Where were you? I've been worried sick. Come closer. Oh, no! I don't like this. <laughs> Is it true that you're responsible for the destruction of Bermesia? No wonder you look so concerned. Far from the truth, she's lying. Those rats have been plotting to destroy Alexandria for some time. I couldn't just wait for them to attack and destroy our precious kingdom. I wonder if that's true though or not. Because the Bermesians did pick up the arts of war, right? But I don't think it is. It seems like they were attacked pretty unprovoked. Their city was like not even... Like they... None of them were doing anything. Had no choice but to take initiative. Uh, I don't believe her. No. You're crazy, Mom. Why wouldn't you believe your mother? Oh, and here's Kuja himself. May I also play a part in this act? act from a beautiful play. There's a knight on a white horse and a beautiful princess. It is a tale of tragic love. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh my god. What is happening here? This is not good. Garnet is asleep. Extract the Eidolons. That's not good. I know we were just talking about Eidolons. Um, with Dr. Tot was saying something about it. It's not, it's... Belated happy birthday, princess. Hee <laughs> hee! 16 years, the princess has become. We can finally draw the Eidolons from her. Okay. <laughs> They're still being opposites of themselves. I didn't even get to summon a single Eidolon. I got my... my, uh... Oh... This is not good. I got my, my trance just one time and it wouldn't let me summon anything. I don't know if I'm gonna lose that power now. That, I feel like that was like, maybe that is supposed to be like a big twist that like, 
Garnet, that like they're doing something to Garnet that we didn't know. I kind of thought she might have like some hidden power like that or something along those lines. Um, but like, that's new. Uh, what's Freya doing here? A thousand years is a long time. Perhaps Braun is behind it. Or the guy who was with Braun. He seems menacing. I'm going to head down to find out why the sandstorm disappeared. I was thinking the same thing. So we'll get Vivi and Queena and we'll go together. Alright. Um, so that is actually going to be our episode for today, guys. So... Clayra is in a bad spot here. The first time in a really long time, it's unprotected by the sandstorm, and we may be in in for another battle when we get to the bottom of this trunk. Garnet's in a bad spot. Everyone is not having a great time right now. Except for me, because I'm playing this again. Whoa! See you next time, guys. I'm in Snag Attack 8. Thanks so much for watching. Later.